Anything you can do in person, you can do using Skype for business. The benefit of Skype is you can do it from your own desk. You can share PowerPoints, share your desktop, even use a whiteboard. You've just started your Skype meeting. You're in your Skype meeting and you're having a conversation and you want to present your desktop. Let's say you have a PowerPoint or an Excel spreadsheet or a photo that you want to share with the other members of the call. You go here to the monitor, you click Present Desktop. Once you do that, then you can choose between your monitors. I'm going to go with my primary monitor. Okay. This now means that everybody who is on the call can see my desktop. It's important to know it's the entire desktop, so if you have things that you don't want everybody to see, please remove them before you start this process. Let's say somebody else on the call says, hey, I have something to share. You click Stop Presenting, and that gives control to somebody else. So now let's say you're in the call and you want to present an Excel spreadsheet or a PowerPoint, you go back to here, present a PowerPoint. I'm going to present a presentation. It's uploading a presentation that I had on my OneDrive. The, the way to make this go a little bit faster is to have everything ready to go inside that Skype call uh, calendar appointment before you do it. Okay, so I've now uploaded my PowerPoint presentation. We walk through it, blah, blah, blah. Again, somebody else on the call has something to say. They want to show me a presentation they did again. Uh, I go to stop presenting and they talk about whatever they want to talk about. The other thing you can do is use a whiteboard. So you can go to more whiteboard and you can start writing. For example, you want to write Skype is nice and useful. I want to highlight it and then I want to send it to myself, save as, on my desktop, and then from there I can send it out to the group afterwards. Today we've learned how to open your Skype meeting, present your desktop, Give control to someone else of your desktop in the meeting so they can share something, take back control, present a PowerPoint, and use the whiteboard. Hope that's useful.